So when I'm not working for WPTV, I volunteer at the Loggerhead Turtle Hospital in Juneau Beach. This year, I worked and followed along with two very sick loggerhead turtles who actually endured Hurricane Irma. Today, I watched them both go back into the wild, bringing what has been a very difficult 2017 full circle. It's a big day at Loggerhead Marine Life Center. Two loggerhead sea turtles once on the brink of death, now going back into the wild. It is wonderful to see two turtles that came in looking so grim um, and be able to rehabilitate them and get them back out. Brother Kenny and Brianna spent the last several months recovering from chronic debilitation. Appreciate this, you know, art of Florida of having turtles come in and then go out back to where they're natural inhabited. The journey hasn't been easy. These two were part of the group of turtles evacuated to Georgia during Hurricane Irma. Sea turtle vet Nicole Montgomery drove them herself. 15 and a half hours. Um, I got there at 5.30 in the morning. This event also highlights the record-breaking sea turtle nesting season at nearly 20,000 nests, despite the devastation from Irma. And since we had a record-breaking nesting season, overall it wasn't a huge loss for us on this section of beach, so that's promising. Uh, make sure the water now that these turtles are fully recovered, volunteers strap them in for the ride down to the beach. Good luck, Brianna! with hundreds of people waiting to help brother Kenny and Brianna ring in the new year back in the ocean. See them come from what they did when they came in to being so healthy and just able to thrive again back in the wild. Now another record breaker this year, researchers also logged some of the latest green sea turtle nests ever laid uh, over a week after nesting actually ended. So look out for hatching, hatchlings coming up in January.